onward to Colorado I go. I am on my way to the get in place aka Target because as you can maybe see in the back there's a new mattress which means I get some new sheets hopefully oh look at this it's a pull through Check it out. Sheets have been acquired. So, onward to Colorado, I go. I honestly have no idea if these sheets will fit. I hope they do. I got twin sized and my mom said to look for double, but I didn't see any double sheets. So, I looked at the dimensions and it was close enough. They might be a little small, but I think we can make it work. Woo! Cut that one a little close. But I made it. gassed up. I think we're ready to go. Oh, do I want food? No, I'll be alright. I think we may be on the wrong side of Pasadena and the grass ain't no shade green. It's just a little Well, that certainly did not take long. My windshield, I just cut a rock. Whoops. But it's going to be fixed in an hour. No, not not more. Not more, please. Thank you. From the place we set out for when we left the church last Easter. Singing hallelujah preacher. I know just what I ought. To. I'll take that. That looks a lot better. And you know what that means? On the road again. I think we may be on the wrong side of 24. We ain't growing like the weeds grow. We just get in old. And I can't really remember if the world is black and white or if I'm living it right. As the kids these days. Got it. Well, this is nice. Ooh, we're going to be living in luxury. Okay, it worked so well, actually. It fits really well. Window covers, so nobody can see in my little home. First, I need my little light. Okay. This goes over here. This one, over this side. Oh. Oh, 
Alrighty. Wrong thing. Look at that. Okay. Close. Shoes need to come off. Okay, I will see you in the morning. Maybe. Lights out. Woo! 21 degrees! <laughs> it's a little chilly this morning. I just crawled out of bed and I need to get moving so this car will warm up faster so I can turn on the heat. Because I'm cold! I don't know how far away I am from Denver. Let's check. Two hours and 46 minutes. That's not bad. I'll be there before I know Starting it. Starting route to Denver. It's easy to forget nothing set in stone. Welcome to Colorado. Ghosts will make their bed if you bring them home. place on earth. I need to get another blanket so that is why I'm here. Something warm because it's supposed to be zero degrees. I'm excited to try these out because I've heard a lot of people love them. I got the nano loft instead of down because I figure it would be good if my down sleeping quilt gets wet. I can't really use it so I didn't want to get down again. So nano loft. Next step on the list is Planet Fitness. Okay, Planet Fitness is done. I wasn't super impressed by that Planet Fitness. 
got the job done, but I didn't have my usual equipment. I was all sad. So then I just felt lost. Um, rule number one of Colorado. I think I'm gonna drive to the mountains. Because I don't wanna stay in town. I am gonna check the weather one last time before I leave though because I don't wanna get caught in any ridiculously bad weather because I don't really have a lot of self recovery gear so I can't afford to get stuck. I can't believe I'm doing this. All right. Starting route to Flagstaff. Proceed to Wadsworth Boulevard. Then turn right. Okay, here we go. So one of the great parts of living on the road is I get to be picky about where I want to stay. And Denver and surrounding area is just not going to cut it right now. So I'm going to head out. Well, guys, this is one of the moments that I am not going the right direction. What? Uh-uh. Nope. <laughs> we aren't driving the mountains right now. I got to Denver and realized pretty quickly that for a number of reasons, it just wasn't going to work out. Number one being, I already ran into some logistics issues with showers and gyms and weather because it's gonna be like zero degrees and my sleeping quilt's rated to 15 and I'm just like, I'm gonna freeze. So it became pretty clear pretty quickly that I needed to keep moving. Keep right to merge onto State Highway 470 East toward Colorado Springs. I am now going the correct direction, I think. We'll find out if I end up in Arizona. I hope I don't get caught in the winter weather. South Fork appears to be quite the festive town. There also appears to be some snow here which is concerning to me, but we shall press on nevertheless. Yeah, this is ice. Yeah, this is definitely ice. Yeehaw. I hope this is not a bad decision because these roads are getting a little bit more snowy. Somebody has a tent up. That's crazy. It is 11.20 and I'm in Durango for the evening. I'm going to hopefully wake up semi-early and continue the drive to Flagstaff. But I am exhausted, so I'm going to bed. I just pulled my window covers. 
I was fully expecting to have to clear snow off this morning. And it actually warmed up overnight. It is 6.15, exactly. And I was a little later getting out of bed than I really expected. It turns up this. <laughs> it looked bizarre. I zipped it all the way up so my necklace wasn't hit my face all night. Um, I lost my train of thought. It's, I literally just climbed out of bed. We made it. Flagstaff, Arizona, the end of the road trip. Finally, I am going to stay here. It's non-negotiable for now. Anyways, I will see you next time as we do a little bit more exploring in Arizona. Until then, I hope you have a fantastic week.